Let's simplify the fraction 1 third. And here's how we can do that. We want to find another fraction that's equivalent. It has the same value as 1 over 3. It's just that we've simplified or reduced it down to lowest terms. To do that, we need to find a common factor, something that goes into both 1 and 3 evenly. When I look at 1 and 3, the only thing that's going to go into both is just going to be 1. So I could divide 1 by 1, and that would give me 1. Divide 3 by 1, that gives me 3. So my greatest common factor is 1, and we end up with what we started with, 1 third. What that means is that 1 third, it's already simplified. You can't reduce this any further. It's in its lowest terms. If you do need to convert 1 third to a decimal, there's a link at the end of this video. But in answer to our question, the fraction 1 third, it's already simplified. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.